right. Thank you for checking out Her Divine Light. I, um, man, my camera stopped me again, so we're just going to keep this moving. This is technically part three, but, you know, sometimes little minis are better. So, this dude is being odd. Thank you for the subscriber who, um, included his name in comments. Feel free to check that out. Somebody's saying George... It looks like Jay Lopez from the... Where is he going? Okay, no, nope, we're going to pause. I'm going to show you where he's going. No, sorry, this is a Rosemont picture, but these are the two doors I'm talking about. These are the two doors where the manager who found the body walked through. So that's kind of the area that he's going towards, okay? Just to reference it all. Okay. No period. It's like, what is he doing? It's like he was looking around. I swear he was looking for hammers, too. Oh. They look like they're having a deep convo out of the camera light. What are they? You saw that little handoff back there. Okay, so this is something. Sorry about this. Let me just adjust myself. All right. So this little area here. I don't know what is in his hand, what his deal is, but I will tell you, they are moving quick. They are moving in such a fashion where it's, okay, it will all unfold. Let's just watch it together. Okay, so just watch. All right, so now there's two for one. A lot of action here. You got him walking fast with this bag. Him, if you can see from his hand here, he just slid something in. I'm going to slow it down in a second, but let's just keep watching it in fast motion. Okay, he's hurrying, hurrying. Look at him trying to stuff it somewhere. Putting his hands back. He's putting his hands over. Now, that might be a shoe. And it looks like there's something that has weight to it. Kind of fiddling around with the body, acting like they're... Huh. Look at how he looked back. Well, if you were watching them the whole time, you wouldn't have to be worrying about their shadiness now. Okay, I'm going to rewind it and slow it down. Wait, what is he doing? Okay. Okay, so I totally don't know if I was even taping crazy, but we are just going to go ahead and watch it again. So, now he has this bag in his hand. And this is kind of after they were having their chat with the body... Um, not chat with the body, I'm sorry. Man, the one I just taped was so good. Sometimes redoing it, it's like, ah, oh, I'm so chatty the first time. Okay, he has this little thing in his hand. Now, it looks like a clear bag. They were writing down some kind of phony report. And then they slid something in the bag. He's just, he's just looking nervous to me. He goes off to the corner. Okay, so... We see that he has this bag in his hand. Now it looks like he put something in here and then I feel that he passes it along to the other guy. I have this on like slow speed. Okay, so you see this bag in his hand. Okay, so he had the bag and he gives it to this guy in the short sleeve. We know this because we can now see it in his hand, all right? Okay, so now we see him moving backwards. Everybody wants to check on the body now. All right, so we see him moving backwards and we see his buddy going with him. Now, it's the first time he actually looked back out of concern. All right, now we see this dude. He's looking up at the cameras, or I guess trying to see if something, and I feel like that's what he's doing. Now, remember, that guy went back there with nothing in his hand. Or did he? Let's see. Alright, so these two, they're having a convo. There is some type of exchange that happens between them, okay? Okay. Just pay attention to this. 
now he has a bag. Something in his hand. Now, you see this something, it was an exchange this way. Watch him and his jacket as, as the time progresses. It's like two for one double trouble, okay? 